Matt here, country song teacher. Guys, I have a lot of requests for this song. Uh, it's going to use three chords with a four count timing with each chord. I got the capo on the third fret. It's going to go a G. I lock in the two bottom strings, fifth and sixth, strum off six. Then to an F. Now, don't let this scare you. I struggled. I, F used to kill me all the time. But type in Matt McCoy F chord. But all I do is go second string of the first fret, skip this fret all together. So just second string. Then I'll take my ring finger and pinky finger and go to the fifth and fourth. It's right there. Let me see. Uh, okay, I thought I, had a, thought I had a customer. I'm down here at my construction job. So again, second string, fifth and fourth. Strum the bottom five. You can. A lot of times I'll take a middle finger on and off that third string to spice the sound up goes. I said, Grandpa, what's this picture here? It's all black and white. Sounds pretty cool, doesn't it? You don't have to worry about that bar chords and that stuff. Just that easy F. Right there. You go, go over. You can do a donation. Say, Matt, just because you taught me how to do an F chord, you get a donation. You get do all donations go to Project 14, the mission work we have in Nicaragua. So go over, do a donation just because you're like, dude, that F chord changed my life. I struggled. So just learn that right there. Second string, fifth and fourth. Sounds just as good. For four. And then for a C, I'm going to lift my pinky finger off and then put the middle finger on the third string. I mean the fourth string, second fret. And that's your C, fourth, and then back to G. So the verses and the chords. I said, Grandpa, what's this picture here? It's all black and white. It ain't real clear as that you there. I said, yeah, I was 11. The times were tough back in 35. That's me and Uncle Joe trying to survive a cotton farm. Now you hear me say all the time, strumming is about timing. Strumming is about timing. So rather than going down, down, up, 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 down, up, 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 that used to confuse me all the time. Start out with just down strums with, to get the internal four count timing. One, two, three, four, F. One, two, three, four, C. One, two, three, four, G. If it looks like we were scared, like a couple of kids just trying to save each other. You should have seen it in color. So you're kind of building, um, you're building the song based on that. So you got the chords down, G, F, C, G. Then you get the timing down, it's four count. Then as you advance, you get where? So I'm doing string stops, palm mutes, hammer-ons, but again, the song is based on the foundation of that one, two, three, four. A lot of times, a, a term called musical discernment, uh, somebody taught me about, a lot of times even when you don't push the song as hard, you kind of just have that simplistic kind of, that kind of rawness will make it kind of sound pretty good, you know? People ask me all the time, what's this capo for? The capo puts it in the key of the song, to fit your voice so you can, and that's what key I think Jamie Johnson plays in. You can put it in different frets and all it's gonna do and play your same chords, it's just gonna switch the tone.
All right, guys, go over and check out CountrySongTeacher.com. Thank you for all the great comments. I try to get to them, back to them fast as I can. Uh, I do these videos a lot of times while I'm down at working and that kind of stuff. So, God bless you guys. Uh, thank you so much. Hope you're enjoying your summer. Check me out over on Snapchat. Uh, I'm goofy on there. Trust me. I'm goofy all the time, but I'm real goofy on Snapchat. Guitar Teacher 44. Subscribe to this channel, and even go like the Facebook.com/slash Country Song Teacher. Even go step over, look at my main channel, AcousticSelection.com. People say, "How do you have the time to do all you do?" I'm like, "I don't know, dude, but I gotta go." <laughs> God bless you.